In today's Clash Royale video, I'll be showing guys how to beat Arena 3 in Clash Royale. I'll be showing guys two decks today. One deck is this Battle Ram uh, Rush deck. Synergy works really well together with all the cards. Defense is really clean and you can get awesome counter push with the Battle Ram. And the second deck I'm going to show is the Spell Bait Goblin Barrel deck. As soon as they use arrows on your spirit goblins or your bomber, you, in you can instantly do Valkyrie and then Goblin Barrel or just Goblin Barrel by itself to instantly get a lot of damage. So let's not wait any longer and begin today's video. Alright, in our first game here, now we're going against this guy, so what's up dude? Alright, so... Um, we're gonna be playing this. Ooh, it's like, that's aggressive. Wow, that is real aggressive. So I'm gonna be playing this. Um, oh, what did I? I'm gonna be playing this um, battle ram deck first. Uh, so yeah, what I really like about this battle ram deck is the counter push is real uh, you can easily defend with tombstone and then get a really fast and easy counter push with the battle ram so that's what i really like about this deck uh, yeah so we have positive elixir to trade right now positive elixir more elixir than him so i'm gonna battle ram plus if he does tombstone or scar me we can always clean it up with the arrows mini pack it down here I Please, please. Okay, okay. We're fine, we're fine. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, my bad. I uh, spent too much elixir there, I guess. So that was my bad. But yeah. So, like... You, you just... To win, you just need a good elixir. You just need to have more elixir than your opponent. And you basically win all your games. It's... It's really easy with this deck. So that's that. Battle Ram. There you go. I don't think he has anything to defend that. Boom. So I'm just gonna leave the Mega Minion. Look, an arrow that actually. Also, at the beginning of the game, try to make sure. Um, you know what, like, your opponent's win condition is. Because you want to, like, save your cards for it. So, like, I know now this guy's playing, um, Goblin Cage here. I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, uh, no. Um. Goblin Barrel. So I, I can always remember to save my arrows. And there we go. You can take that out pretty easily. And I'm going to build a big push. Arrow that. Look at this push. We won. Barbarian. Oh. It's fine. That's fine. Just spam a bunch of stuff. And uh, hopefully we win. Yeah, there you go. As you guys can see, this deck is really easy to play, and just as once as you get a positive elixir trade, you are able to get almost like guaranteed damage. So let's hop right into our next game. Alright, game against 9009. What's up, dude? Um, good luck to him, like I always do. So. Put you Valk in the back? Yeah, that's fine. Back here, remember? Uh, whoa, this guy playing battle room. Oh, I messed. Oh, never mind. Wait, why did I do that? I, I thought I messed up my placement. I don't play with battle room often, so sorry, guys. Um, oh, God. I'm in, I'm in trouble. Uh, 
Yeah, I spent too much elixir. So yeah, I was down. Okay. Cause like I thought I messed up my um skeleton placement. Uh tombstone placement. So I freaked out for a second there. But he doesn't have much elixir either. Or, <laughs> or something, cause Wow. Right, I'm going to defend this with the cheapest option possible. I'm gonna scar me. Go and tombstone. Remember the um, giant's range is far back, so we can defend it with. We we can put the tombstone pretty far off. That is a positive elixir trade. I'm gonna battle him. Arrow that like right now. See if I can get scar me. Uh, it's fine though, cause barbarian ba uh, battle ramp, so we can next. Army that. There you go. This deck is really good. Uh, also, because if let's say your opponent has like giant and battle ram, if you don't have your building, you can always do. You can always use Carmi to defend. Gonna leave that barbarian. It's gonna do one hit. Um, me to defend. Oh, he just messed up bad other side. Like, I'm I'm gonna scar me on a Valkyrie. So. Yeah, I'm gonna mini pack a... This deck has so many tank killers as well. Which is really fun about it. It's another tower taken down. And that should be a dominant W. As you guys can see, you just need to keep your elixir advantage and try to defend correct, uh, ch as cheap as possible. You will be able to win your games. Alright, so now, um, let's play our um, Goblin Barrel deck. Alright, so we have a game with Chicky Sequita. So, good luck. And, ooh. Spirit goblins, right there. Clean that up for pretty cheap. And ooh, wow. Actually, bomber right here, just the bait. All right, we're fine. Two they cancel each other out pretty nicely. So we only took one minion hit, which is good. I'm gonna mini pack in the back. Memory cards like mini pack, um, bomber, Valkyrie—they're really good to do in the back. Also, a really nice option. Gonna go Valk. Um, scar me in a Valk. That's that's strange. So now, for a split second, Valkyrie is gonna tank if I. Yeah, see? So now I can get damage. Look at that. Goblin Barrel connects. I just love this deck. Out of the two, I would prefer this one. But, like I said, we all have... I, 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 like I said. Never mind. Anyways. Um, yeah, so. A lot of people have different playing styles. So. Um, yeah, I have... I put two decks in this video. But you can use either one. It doesn't matter. Both are really good. Let's continue the back here. And so the main idea of this deck is try to get your opponents to play like... To play like their spells. And then after they play their spell you can go go Goblin Barrel. So now they'll have a harder time defending. Oh well, look at this. We have so much elixir. We can even fireball that. Boom. We get a knight. That is tower. That would die. And I'm going to musk in the back. Right. I'm going to Valkyrie. 
Yeah, what is he? Oh no! Oops! 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 oops. Oh no! 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 It's it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. And then, Valkyrie tanks. So the tower focuses on the Valkyrie, and we can get really nice damage with the Goblin Barrel. That is an easy win with this deck. The stack is really good since uh, Valkyries can clean up everything, Baby Dragon can splash onto everything, and um, Goblin Barrel just does ton of damage. So let's play our last game. Right, Jiro. So, um, say good luck to him. And in this case, Musketeer in the back. Okay. Oh wait, that that splashed into my tower. That was my mistake. Anyways. Mmm. Maybe I shouldn't have done that Valkyrie. I'm not gonna fireball because I will be spending too much elixir. And I don't wanna spend too much elixir. Oh yeah, okay, okay. Fireball that. Um, there we go, hopefully we can, there you go, clean everything up with the Valkyrie. Okay, that was tough defense, um, come on, yes, let's go. Bomber hit as well, let's get to you right there. And hopefully, maybe we can, mm. I'm going to Goblin Barrel System. Ah. It's fine though. Yeah, he spelled too late. Uh. I'm just gonna save my elixir and not do anything about Musketeer. It's Cause that is only gonna get one hit. I'm gonna Bomber. It goes for Giant. I don't wanna uh, Tombstone early yet. Because that will just get wasted. So I think he's trying to build like up a big push. He's he is gonna put something behind that, right? No, he doesn't. Okay, I'm just gonna do that. Now tombstone, and yeah, we should be fine. Look at that. Get really nice trades. Goblin barrel right there. Look at that. Look at this damage. I'm gonna bomber to kill the archers. And this deck is this deck's amazing. The synergy of it is really good as well. I just love it. So I'm gonna not play Tombstone because I know he is going to do giant pretty soon. I kinda need tower damage, so I'm just fireball that. Goblin Barrel, because mini packet of tank. Oh, and there we go. That is another really great win using our um, spell bait Goblin Barrel deck. And that will be the end of today's video. So, if you liked the video, please like and subscribe, because that will help me out a lot. And I hope you found this video helpful. I hope you learned something new, and I hope you were able to get past the arena. So, that is all for today, and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye!